Hello everyone, this is Linda. Yes, I'm here with my garlic and I have a great report. There is garlic. Yeah, man. That's garlic. That's just weed. <laughs> and let's see here. Let me move this, but this is garlic right there. Yeah, so we got some garlic coming up. Mm-hmm. So I planted um, one garlic in this this pot and look at there. Yep, that's garlic. Yeah, I'm excited. So guys, I really do not have to tell you guys that it is extremely hot but as you can see the wind is blowing I'm under my weeping willow tree and I am getting a little breeze going on just a little breeze going on but it's still very hot but listen this is my weed barrier or you know it's um, garden fabric but I purchased this from um, Dollar Tree. Now, I must have purchased about maybe between 15 or 20 of these at the beginning of the uh, spring season. And this is my last one I'm using right now. But all of my barascas is just being fried by the sun. I mean, literally fried by the sun. So what I did was I put this garden fabric just like that. And basically I just have most of it uh, where the sun comes up. Uh, so this, this is the side that the sun comes up. And as you can see back there, I have some barascas in some pots. So I put them just behind the screen now the sun, when, by the time the sun gets over and on the other side, it is not as strong as it is when it's first coming up, of course. So now all of my little barascas is behind some uh, shade, and uh, hopefully they will uh, do better and not get so fried up. Uh, and it's just one way I, you know, I, I listen, I kind of hook that thing up, you know. <laughs> But hey, you know, it, it's working, it's working. So all of them are in there and um, so hopefully this will keep them from being uh, cooked before I cook them, you know. <laughs> but guys, it is so hot. I mean, my body is just ringing wet. I mean, you know, like from head to toe, I am just... Uh, full of sweat yeah and um, I wouldn't dare wear um, shorts out here in the garden simply because the mosquitoes will just tear my legs up so that's why I have on my leggings and um, yeah keep my uh, my legs and even my ankle and my feet I'm being attacked by uh, mosquitoes but it is a beautiful day still, you know, I thank God for it. And I've been having a great, uh, great Sunday. I hope you guys are having a great Sunday also. And uh, here's my other garlic and it's doing really well. But I'll show you guys what I did on last night. So this is one of the um cannings jars I did and I did three of these jars like this but in this one I have some of my um oriental beans in here I have uh sereno peppers I have uh habaneros I have uh what else is in here uh, like every pepper in my garden jalapenos is in here and all I did was, in the jar, I put one teaspoon of sugar, um, 
one teaspoon of uh, mustard seed, a teaspoon of celery seed, and a teaspoon of dill seed. Also, I chopped up some garlic. I put a garlic and a half in each one because I like that garlic flavor. Then I put um, a little salt. And for my brine, I do two to one. I do one cup of vinegar to two cups of water. And this time I used apple cider vinegar and I put that in there and kind of heated it up a little bit. Now I did not put them in my water bath because it will have my house so hot. And that is one thing I don't need now. I, I don't need no extra heat going on. So I just put it all in this jar and uh, put it in my refrigerator. Now I have it dated here and it will be ready to eat on September 2nd. So Joseph loved these things. We he eat them with everything from burgers to um, nachos to uh, I cooked some greens and he put them on his greens. So hey, I love them. So that's what I did with um, my canning on last night. And that's just to save, you know, so you how don't get so hot. I only had three jars and just to heat up all of that water, have my house all hot. No, it wasn't worth all that. So it's just as good and just as delicious when you just do it this way also. Yeah. So I think I'm going to go over to Dollar Tree and hopefully I can find another uh, bag of fabric. And if I do, I put it in a bag. But seriously, it's not necessary. It's just to keep the sun off of them. And I think this is going to work out really well. But anyway, I hope you guys have a great, great Sunday. Yes, yes, have a great Sunday. And uh, if you are new to my channel, please, please stop by. You have stopped by. And subscribe. And uh, we can be a part of each other's world. All right, guys. You all have a great, great day. Later, y'all.